what's up guys welcome back to the channel if you're new to the channel drop a thumbs up comment below oh dude oh is that a bear she's got her cubs with her too Makeshift deer blind, maybe? I don't know. All right, let's keep walking. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel new to the channel please drop a thumbs up comment below share with your friends and family huh. found a piece of pottery like a plate or something but anyways back to the video
That's a big piece of coal. Power some powerful steam engines with that right there. I'm not hiking that out. That thing weighs probably five, six pounds. Cool find though. So <clears throat> I found this square nail and uh, looks like a, another square nail here. But uh, the reason why I was interested in this area, let me lose that, put that over here, um, is because of this piece of pottery. And I found it on this little pile. And there's some, oops, there's some bone there and some bone there. And it looks like this might be like a, an old, maybe possible trash dump or something because this area right here is part of the whoo got a head rush that one was whoo no so this looks like it's been all cleared out because right about in there is a nice straight shot and then along the tree line here is the old railroad abandoned railroad so this looks like it has been cleared out possibly for an old camp or maybe like a siding for the trains to pass each other. Um, it's pretty decent size, but I just came to sit down on this, this log, take a break. But uh, let's get back to this little area right here. All right, let's check it out. Let's dig it up. Just using the hands and the pin pointer right now. So, looks like I may have pulled it out. And it's probably another nail. Huh. I think my battery's dying. I'm gonna go change it out real quick. All right, changed the battery out, but I did find the culprit for what was making it beep it was this little tiny screw piece. So let's keep digging. Brand new battery in here. Yeah. What's that? Oh wow! Oh dude! Dude, I think this is a. This looks like a clay pipe piece. Here's the the center. Oh wow! That's awesome. All right, so this does look like a clay pipe piece. You can see how it's round in the middle. Um, that's that'd be a pretty big pipe, but uh, yeah, that's that's super cool, man. Yee yee, pipe piece. All right, well, let's see what else we have. All right, let's check it out. Oh, get in there. Move that out of the way. Oh, 
there it is. I think that's it. Is that it? No, oh, that's a rock. That was down all the time. <laughs> oh wait, I gotta turn back on. All right, it's right there. All right, it's out. hole anymore. Oh, there it is. It is another square nail. Right on. Alright guys, I just found something really cool. Um, and all I've been using is my uh, Mine Lab Profine 15 pr uh, pin pointer and uh, my Grave Digger Grave Digger Tools Sidekick, um, but I've already seen it, but check this out. This is super cool, man. It's a pulley system, or a pulley. And uh, it was down about there. Oh, wait. And, oh, dude, what is this? Oh, holy crap. Oh, wow, dude. That's a freaking chisel piece. Wow. So I, wow. All right. <laughs> so I found a chisel piece and this pulley in this one hole, um, all using a pin pointer. All right, so the more and more I look at this this whole area right here, I'm seeing more of this burnt wood um, bone looking stuff. Here's a piece of sheet metal from back in the day. But um, I mean, that that's a pretty straight cut on this rib bone. And you could see right here, that's actual human teeth marks on these ribs um, but that that's a straight cut right there so this is obviously a beef rib well I don't know obviously but that's a beef rib and those are human teeth marks so this whole area is littered with all this stuff and I did find some pottery oops save that one for last put it right there but here's, here's a piece of a plate. Looks like it's been burnt on the bottom. Um, here's another piece of modern pottery. See a little rim right there. And then here's a piece of porcelain, like the other one I found. But uh, this one is really cool. It's another pipe piece. You can see how it is, oops, and into the milk this one. Uh, it's small, it's probably like a piece of bone, but yeah, you can see it right there. It's nice and round, it's pretty heavy, so it uh, might be clay, I don't know, 
But yeah, I found two pieces of uh, pipe pieces, first time. Yee yee. Alright, so I have this potential piece and this potential piece. So, ah, uh, I know what that is. That is a lid or a top of a stove. Um, and that's where probably a burner set or a plate. So, and then this piece here. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. That's super cool. It's a, probably a bowl, porcelain bowl. or something but oh there's a piece of little glass right here oh yeah there's the neck that's super cool so yeah this whole area all these dandelions and all these little mounds that's all like a dump site it goes all the way over here into these trees that are downed Super cool. All right, guys, this is what I found all with just a pen pointer <clears throat> while I was sitting and having lunch. Um, so we're gonna start on this end. We got the rib bone of some kind of animal with human teeth marks on it. Um, Archaeology, this is the Science Channel YouTube. Um, pulley. Screwed into a ceiling, probably. Um, a pulley system. Uh, this chisel is super cool. Um, didn't even expect to find it in the same hole with this. Found a little baby 22 pew pew right there. Whole bunch of square nails. A little big old hunkin' square nail. Little baby screw. Some cool pieces of pottery. And then some chunks of metal. And my ultimate find, and I've already lost the other piece, um, is this pipe piece. I've never found a pipe piece. Uh, you can see the groove right there. Uh, this is a clay, piece of glazed clay pipe. Um, and I had another one. I don't know where it went. Uh, hopefully I can find it. But that's all I found while sitting here having lunch. And, uh, well, it was kind of unexpected to find all this Just curiosity so <laughs> this is a pretty cool find I think I know what this is um, I'm thinking a either a wooden dowel or a metal rod would go in this hole and these two screws would hold it down and this would be like part of a railing system for maybe like uh, <clears throat> stairs going up um, into a building or possibly a railing on a train seeing that this is um, on the southern Rio Grande Railroad from Rico to Dolores Colorado and this is a, a surface find. found it right there yee yee wrapped it look at this uh, super super blue piece of uh, glass this looks like some kind of milk glass or something. That's super blue. That's beautiful. Super cool find. So I just found a couple square nails. So that indicates um, before 1880, I believe. Um, and these are hand forged square nails that uh, someone actually put in a in a hot furnace and heated them up and pounded them out but uh, this is a pretty cool piece of glass blue glass um, looks like it might be a neck to a or a bottom I mean to a bottle but uh, just yeah this this whole area is just littered with stuff like this uh, surface finds and and whatnot it, it just goes all over so right in here you can see these little pieces of pottery this one has flowers on it little pink flowers it's pretty cool there's several pieces of 
of this pottery right here. And uh, a couple pieces of metal. But yeah, that's super cool. You can still see the, the pink flowers on there. Leave those here for the next person. Yep, definitely bear. I didn't notice this on the way in, but it's a uh, railroad, railroad tie plate. That looks like um, probably, I don't know. Really cool find though, we're gonna leave it right here. It's too big. What's up guys? Thank you for watching the video. Please drop a thumbs up, comment below, let everybody know about this video. Um, I really wasn't planning on doing much, but it turns out that uh, I found like a old railroad dump site, but that's okay. <clears throat> Pretty cool spot. Get me here for a couple hours, but need to go home. And um, thanks for watching. Thank you for the support. Love you guys. Um, I came out here to get my mind clear. It's working. Um, I, I just can't be locked up inside and out here is where I belong. See you on the next one.